Watch this review here, and if you're anything like me, you've probably been seeing these Pepsi things all over the place, which apparently is a throwback to the good old days when they used to make them with real sugar. Wait, what? What the hell does this mean with real sugar? And why is it only for a limited time? If they don't use sugar in normal Pepsi, what the hell do they use? Sugar babies? Sugar bugs? Sugar man? Oh yeah! You know, because that's what they do with the Kool-Aid man. So this question's been like bugging me for a week, so I finally googled it up and I found us an answer. Now if you look through the list of ingredients, there's one ingredient missing, and that would be uh, high fructose corn syrup. So yeah, no HFC, whatever that is, but I guess that does make sense um, because I remember seeing some ad campaigns complaining or actually advocating in favor of high fructose corn syrup or whatever it is. Just because it's gotten some bad PR lately. I don't know why. I guess probably because the government subsidizes our corn industry or something stupid like that. And as a result, it's a uh, cheap sugar substitute. So, um, for those of you who haven't tasted this, it tastes basically the same as normal Pepsi. I mean, I've had stomach problems off and on since I started drinking these. So I'm not sure if it's from this or I just have some sort of a uh, stomach bug. I mean, I'm not trying to poison anybody against the idea of Pepsi here. I'm sure that Pepsi's ad campaigns have poisoned people enough against the idea of Pepsi. Don't get me wrong, I'm actually a Pepsi fan. I just don't like Coke as much. Um, now, although this does taste the same, there's just one really important difference. If you actually smell the two drinks, the ones with made with real sugar just have a much richer aroma, and it's actually pretty pleasant. <sighs> good stuff, good stuff. So yeah, this might be worth checking out if you're a Pepsi fan. And by the way, they're doing this for a whole bunch of them. It's not just the, uh, what's this, 2 liter bottles. It's also on the 20 ounces and even across some of the other brands. Now, like, not just the strictly Pepsi whatever classic. I don't know what you'd even call it, but I don't think they're doing it for the diets. I thought I saw some diet packaging, but I'm thinking, how could they do it for diet? They use an artificial anyway. They use, uh me or some weird thing, chemical that gives people gas at times. It gives me gas at least. Plus it tastes really really awful. I hate all those sugar substitutes, you know, besides the stuff that actually tastes like sugar, like the uh, high fructose corn syrup or whatever. Plus what's the point of drinking soda if it's going to be diet? I mean that kind of is kicking yourself in the face. It's like getting calories and then just not getting any fun out of it. <laughs> And they're also doing this for the uh, Mountain Dews, I think. I don't know offhand, I don't drink Mountain Dew either. I mean, I drink Mountain Dew, like, if I'm someplace and they have Mountain Dew but they don't have Pepsi, and it's like, I have to pick between Mountain Dew and root beer. Ugh. I'll take the Mountain Dew. But yeah, until next time, folks, stay crazy.